What's up guys, Stefano here, and welcome back to episode 2 of The Walking Dead The New Frontier, and it's called Ties That Bind, and it's part 2, so let's continue on then. So it seems as if we've went um, back in time again. Please, let me do the dishes. That's the least I can do. I'm crashing here. Crashers clean dishes. Your family. Besides, if they're not clean the right way, David becomes a big baby about it all. I'm a pro at this point. I insist. No, Let no. me. I insist. Grab this sponge and you're going to be eating it too. It's not a big deal. I've got it. Nah, I know you don't mind, but I, I won't be here for too long. Just, you know, gotta get back on my feet a little. You're right. I don't mind. But David does. Is that it? Maybe a little bit. No, actually, forget I said that. Uh, that wasn't for me to... Just forget it. Sorry. <sighs> well, he can just deal with it. He's always giving me shit for not being around anyway. Your family. That means the door's always open. So where do you think you'll go? Dunno. With what happened? I'd be amazed if I could get a job assistant coaching T-ball. You'll land on your feet. Well, here's hoping. I could use a fresh start. Uh, I'll, I'll probably just travel around, you know, see what's out there. Want to take me with you? Well? You're married? Well, what about David? <laughs> what about David? Kate. I know, I know. I'm just messing around. It's just... Hard to say no to a fresh start. Always wanted to go to Norway. See the northern lights. But you'll be jet setting and I'll still just be here. Oh, oh god damn it. Oh Ooh, shit. Quick, shit, run shit, underwater. Shit. Well, that was David's army glass. Oh, he's gonna be so pissy about it. I can hear him already. Oh, it's so annoying. Yeah. Just blame me. What well, he'll buy it. I'm the idiot fuck up, right? That's true. Exactly. There you go. See, much better. What was that noise? Yeah, she definitely has a thing for him. Guys. You're You're gonna be okay. Hello? My CEO gave me that. And unless you want to dig up his fucking corpse, he's not going to give me another well, why one. Why don't we get an actual dishwasher? Oh, here we go again. Then you won't be on my ass anytime there's a spot on a fork. Excuse me? If we could even afford a dishwasher. It's just a glass. It is just a glass. It was important to me, Javi. A glass? We don't see your ass for a year. A year. Then when your life goes to shit, we're expected to drop everything and roll out the red carpet. All for Prince Javi. And now you're gonna start telling me how to talk to my wife? This isn't about him. Really? He's the one standing right there judging me for something he doesn't understand. You don't know him like I do. Always judging everyone. Except himself. You know what, time David? Off. Time for you to open your eyes. Kate's gonna leave your ass. What? She told Hobby. me so. You said that? Jesus fucking Christ, no! We were talking about traveling and I just... No, I definitely didn't say that at all. Three days, then I want you off my couch and out the door. We clear? Fine. Javi, that is my husband. We are married, in case you forgot. That's for life. Uh, maybe I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> but then again, present day. We did kiss each other and she did a mind, so... We'll just keep rolling with it anyway. Wait, okay, so he was currently hit by that flashbang. We'll need to get ready for some quick time events that's going to happen soon. Oh, zombie. Hey, hey, take it easy. No way Clem finished all them off, did you? What happened? They got away. 
Oh, Maybe they searched her bodies at least. Mariana. I already dug a grave for her. Thank you. So Clementine's basically going to be replacing that we girl Mariana. If she does join the group technically. So he's currently burying his niece. So he's only looking at for his nephew and his husband's wife, which is probably going to be his girlfriend next anyway. I'll never, we'll never forget, forget you. you. You were a good sister to game. And... And like a daughter to me. Javi... Thank you for staying. I think you probably saved my life. Oh, I guess I did. I couldn't leave you alone. That's because you're a good man. I'm not good enough to save her. You bought your people time, though. That counts for something. I'll grieve. Um, do we leave to cassette player? No, we'll fill the grave. Because the cassette player could be used for someone else. Even the brother to give, give to the brother to remember her by. I'm sorry I never found you those candy bars. He deserved just so much more life. <laughs> that was one big load of dirt there that he had. Covered her whole face and up the you body there. You should have been the one burying me. Some someday, someday far away. <laughs> he fell in the whole hole that time. More. You did everything you possibly... You don't know why you're taking out your guns. There's probably a knife or something you could use. You're gonna fire on one zombie. Okay, so that's one of the guys from before. I have to shoot him. Oh, they're branded. They're clown tag, basically. The other guys had this too. Oh, shit. What? Well, what's wrong? Clem? I've run into these guys before. Who are they? Please. They call themselves the New Frontier. They used to be decent people. Now they're something else. This brand they have, it's like an initiation thing. I was kind of stuck in their camp for a while. Not by choice. It was bad. I'm lucky to be alive. What do you mean stuck? What do you mean stuck? Were you a prisoner? I got out. That's all that matters. They left one of their cars behind. That's something at least. Good. Just like you always wanted. She might stay. 
We helped her. I can take her. you back to Prescott. Make sure your family's okay. But then I'm hitting the road. Stay with us. Stay with us. Let's just get back to Prescott. Not gonna lie, but I probably would have tucked out their shovel with us again. <laughs> Never know what it could be used for. You're back. How's Kate? She just came out of surgery. Eleanor's still with her. You'd best get over to the infirmary. Okay, she seems okay. You made it back. She asked for you. You know. I, I got could. here as soon as I could. Those guys didn't go down without a fight. And then, Mariana. I managed to stabilize her. Those bastards did her one favor, at least. Any lower, and that bullet would have torn her stomach lining as well. Your boy Gabe. He seems really fierce. He wanted to help so badly. He practically forced me to let him stay. That's Gabe. But she was bleeding so much, he... got overwhelmed. So when's she going to be up on her feet again? She's stable. For now. But she's still bleeding inside. I don't want to lie to you. It's probably just a matter of time. I... I wish I could do more. Well, no, I can't lose her. I don't accept that. I can't. I've done everything I can for now. I'm sorry, Javi. I'm going to get cleaned up. You Keep. may want to find Gabe. Wonder could you like try to burn her insides? Upset when he left. Like cauterize make him feel her insides. Better. Maybe stop breathing. Still. I'll track him down. Don't know why you would do that, like, but. Hey, right, what's correct for this guy? How's she doing? Not great. As well as can be expected. Yeah, considering. You should have come back with us. Your family, they needed you. Uh, but I couldn't leave Clem. Valentine needed my help back there. She could take care of herself. Your family, they were the ones who needed help. It's a hell of a situation. Just know I'm praying for you. All of you. And whatever happens, you all are welcome to stick around in Prescott. If that's what you want. Nobody's going to force you, but we'd be glad to have you all here. Not gonna make a decision like that without talking to Kate, so I'd rather check in with her when she's feeling better, you know? Sure thing. Let the lady weigh in first. <laughs> I have to. I see where he's looking at anyway. His armor truck. I know Trip drove like hell to get Kate back here. Got a plane. Probably doesn't work though. Flew in a plane just like this to a baseball game in Arkansas once. Lifetime ago. Now I can talk to this guy. Hey, have you seen a kid come through here? Blood all over his hands. Dark look on his face. Headed off that way without saying a word. If I were you, I'd give him some space. Just my advice. One parent to another. Uh, he's had a shit he's day. He's had a really bad day. Can't let him go off by himself. Not right now. 
Sorry to hear that. That blood, I take it that wasn't his? His stepmom's. You gotta stay strong for her. Do whatever it takes. Know if my friend seen one in the same situation. I'd to be fair, yes, he help. had his stepmom's blood, but by God, he lost Anything his sister too. Do to help you out. Just let me know. I uh, appreciate that. Your boy stomped off towards the front gate. Okay, well, let's go and check what was happening over here. So we'll look at it first. Is that bottled water, maybe? It is. Can we pick up one? Okay, hopefully no one saw that. It looks like they said take free. It looks like, this is, like it says they're free, so it should be okay, maybe. I don't know if I can go back this way as much. Yeah, so we'll have to go find the brother then. We're examining the perimeter wall currently. Hmm. Doesn't look super sturdy. Yeah, well, it's holding everybody in so far. Yeah, there's no way we get accident. Remember her sister by. Yep, he will remember that. I, Good choice. I don't deserve to have this. I want to go back and bury Mariana. We buried her. It was peaceful. How could it have been peaceful? I know I how too. much you miss her, Gabe. I miss her too. And Kate, she needed me during her surgery. She needed my help. I just ran away like a stupid little kid. So I'm You so stayed perfect. long enough to do some good. And because of that, I'm proud of you. You were there for her. As much as you could be. That doesn't count. I'm done feeling this way. Feeling powerless. I can't be some helpless little boy anymore. I need to be a man. Just like my dad was. He knew how men were supposed to act. You're already a man. You're already a man, Gabe. I'm not. But at least I know it now. Next time, I'm not gonna sit back and watch. I'm gonna do something. I have to. Listen, Gabe. Oh, someone's arriving. Was that Clementine come back? Shit. No, no, Get she was. She would have originally took him back, so. Is it a fight on our hands? Well, there's no achievement. Bloody business. We're on to episode 2. We've completed chapter 1, we're on episode 2 now. We might have to leave. Make sure Kate's ready. You can count on me. Thought you kicked her ass out. Oh, they're going to bulldoze. And there's zombies on the inside. Knock, knock. Anyone home? Shit. He was one of the men at the junkyard. These are those freaks that brand themselves. I wish we hadn't had to come all the way out here, but unfortunately, Badger here says you attacked his man. He says you fired on him. Took out a lot of our people. And you expect me to feel bad about fighting back? Because I don't. How many of my friends died because of you, huh? Sounds like a bunch of he said, she said shit to me. 
Well, what the fuck do you want? An apology? What I really want is for my dead buddies to be alive again. But I don't think that's too likely, is it? He needs to come with us. Answer to justice. Accept his punishment. Men okay, so the absolute I, I can't see. No better than the animals. Let's just talk this through. It ain't so simple. Fact of the matter is, you stole from us. You killed some of us. Give it up now and get down here. Can I take a fresh shot or something? I think they need a little incentive. Is it? Oh, it's the frame. You hurt her? I'll kill you. Whoa! You didn't tell me you had a hostage. It's gonna be okay, baby. I love you, I'm baby. All right, baby. Just, just give them what they want. There's no reason this has to get ugly. But we ain't leaving without what we came for. You hurt her, and I'll hurt you back worse than you could ever imagine. Big words. The words are just that. Don't know what to work off. Jesus. Mercy! Oh my god. Now get your ass oh down here. Or please. I cut off the rest of them. What the hell are you doing? Javi, please, man. Just just go with him. You got to. He'll kill Francine. Nobody's giving in to them. We should start shooting. No fucking way. He'll kill Francine. He might kill her anyway, Conrad. We gotta risk it. No. Uh-uh. No way. We do not open fire while she's down there. Wait, I'm coming down. It's cool. I'm coming out. I'm all yours. Thank you. I don't know, man. Me neither. Good man. Let's lock him in the truck and get the hell out of here. I don't want to wait that long. Jesus Christ. Come on. Wait. I want to see him pay for what he did. We got so, what we came for, that. Badger. I'll fucking kill you. I'll kill all of you for what you did. Somehow, I don't think that's what's happening. Nice girl plan. Oh, she got shot in the back. Oh, what the fuck? We don't have the go ahead. No, fuck you. Fuck the go ahead. Ram the fucking gate. Jesus Christ. And now there's all the zombies out. Actually, it's not too many of them. Oh, is that smoke grenade though? Because you'll definitely not be able to see it. Tear gas. I have to find Kate and Gabe. Can you help us? <laughs> Go, man. I'll hold these assholes off. <laughs> All right, we need to see this guy. The wrong button I had actually stayed away there. Right, continue. I'll probably restart off. Oh, what the fuck? We don't have the go ahead. No, fuck you. Can't skip that wee bit. No, right, we'll have to keep going. Fuck the go ahead. Ram the fucking gate. Jesus. 
Jesus Christ! Here comes the tear gas end again. See this one again. <laughs> then the thing in here is going to grab us. We'll press the right button this time. Oh, take the knife with you, man. That's what he did. Bobby! Gabe! <laughs> I've got this one. Walking Dead, the new frontier. Fuck. Oh no, good. Let's climb with them. Yep, good. Let's see most of our group has died. So we're going to reach even there, enemy at the gates. Did a chapter two of episode two. Not just the other car. Looks like we're okay. Eleanor, thank God. I can't believe it. All of our friends, all those people. Oh, Conrad. Are you going to blame me for it? That's just deserve better. She deserved better. They all deserve better. You barely knew her. What the hell do you care? You're the reason they came to Prescott in the first place. She's there because of you. Conrad? Easy, buddy. This wasn't his fault. Bullshit. Francine? Prescott? All because this washed up cheat walked through our gates. I should have known it the second I looked at you. You ain't gonna stand up for nobody but your own. We. We just lost someone, too. So. Say what you have to say. What? That's supposed to make me feel better? Calm down, Conrad. Please. All I know is, if it wasn't for him. Back uh -oh. the fuck off! Now! Just back away! Take it easy, son. Gabriel! Put it away! Now! He's gonna hurt you! No way! Just do it already. 
I don't even care anymore. Just put it down, Gabe. Come on, kid. Right, Gabe, I said. Don't make me repeat myself. Don't touch my uncle again. Fuck me. Gabe! Let him go. He just needs to cool off. <laughs> <laughs> we have to go back. We have to bury her. I wish we could, but Prescott's overrun. We can't go back. Well, we're not safe here either. What about Richmond? I've heard there's a community there. If it's true, they'll have food, walls, maybe even a hospital. Can someone please tell me where AJ is? Well, what I has she done with him? To find the motherfuckers who did this. They took my home. They took my... God damn it! Right, let's listen the to him. one thing we all need is a place to call home. Maybe Richmond can be that place. Richmond? Huh. It's something at least. <sighs> yeah. Fuck it. Let's go. Okay, at least he agrees. It's good. Maybe they'll hit it off. Uh, hope so. Hope so. Might be good for them both. They need someone their own age they can talk to. Come on, guys. We got a long drive ahead of us. So, guys, I'm going to end this week episode here. If you enjoyed it, remember to leave a like, subscribe, and catch me in the next one. Then, thanks again for watching.